What's going on, everybody? Just a real quick hitter today. Wanted to quickly go over intense scoping in voice flow because I was just working on a project and I came across an issue that's not super obvious when you're first learning voice flow and when you're going through a lot of the tutorials. So I'll just show you what I mean real quick. We'll start this flow from here. Uh, we're not going to worry too much about what's actually going on. It's mostly just intense scoping and how the conversation can sometimes route the ways you don't want. So it's asking for an email address in this case to check the status of an order. I'm going to put in this particular email address, which is triggering the intent. So basically what happens here is that we're checking the store to the status of an order and it asks for an email. I put in my email address and then for whatever reason, this join rewards program intent thinks that I want to join the rewards program. And instead of checking my order status, it jumps me completely out of that flow and starts me down this join rewards program flow. So obviously that would be a bad user experience if that actually happened to a customer. So the way to fix this is to go back to the capture step where we were capturing the email. You'll select it and we just want to capture the email. We don't want to look anywhere else for any other intents. We don't want to listen for anything else going on. We just want to capture the email. So you'll click the step, you'll click this little settings, go to intense scoping, and instead of listening for all intents, you only want to listen for intents in this step, which are actually, there's no intents in this step listed. We're just capturing the email and saving it to a variable. That's all we're doing. So we change that. We'll run this again just to make sure it works. Good. So we're getting the order information, the order status to pull through. Now you can see it did still detect that intent. Uh, I can troubleshoot that and figure out why it's picking up that intent from this email. It doesn't make too much sense to me at first glance. But even so, even though it picked up the intent, it didn't transfer me to a whole different part of the flow. It just continued down this flow and retrieved the order information, which is exactly what we want. So that's it for this video. Just a real quick hitter on how you can fix this fairly common but frustrating issue if you haven't seen it before and know how to fix it so that's what i wanted to go over thank you for watching